They've been hard at work shooting season 7 of their critically acclaimed show for the past few months after a gripping series 6 finale. But Outlander's leading stars Katrina Balf and Sam Hewen took a break from filming to attend a special event celebrating the show at the Linwood Dunn Theatre at the Pickford Center for Motion Study in Hollywood on Sunday. Slipping on glamorous outfits for Starts' Outlander FYC special screening and panel, the pair looked worlds away from their beloved characters Claire Fraser and James Jamie Mackenzie Fraser. Katrina was a vision as she walked out in a plunging red midi dress, cut in unusual knitted material. The Irish beauty offset her bold outfit with a pair of pointed white leather boots, and accessorized with just a few simple silver rings. The star's short raven locks were styled into a straight bob, and her tousled fringe helped to frame her pretty face, which she accentuated with natural makeup. Katrina's on-screen partner was also perfectly suited and booted for the occasion, as he slipped on a navy strong suit and white arcade shirt. Sam wore a crisp white shirt to contrast his dark attire, and he looked dapper as he wore it buttoned up to the top without a tie. The actor did not appear to be rocking his character's trademark fiery red tresses as his dark hair was brushed back over his head, but his cropped beard did make him look ruggedly handsome. The pair were joined at the event by executive producers Ronald D. Moore, Meryl Davis, Matthew B. Roberts and Tony Graffia, as well as production designer John Gary Steele. While they remained tight-lipped about what's in store for the show, the group did talk in detail about the character's journey in season 7. Of Jamie, Sam said, they've lived a life, particularly for Jamie it was a great journey for him to lose the one he loved. He had to rebuild himself and find who he is without her and then she comes back into his life again and turns everything upside down, it's a great story. Katrina went on to talk about her character as well, and added, a lot of her drive is for her unborn child, and in the first five episodes of season three you see a woman who is compromised. Even though she's successful professionally and she loves her daughter, she lives with the ghost of this man who changed her entire being. Dot dot.